Hello everybody and welcome back to The Breeze once again. Now you notice that I didn't pray, play a Breeze jingle this time around. I decided to take a little break for the time being until I decided to use Breeze jingles again. I just want to get right into it. And you see right, I have, jingle jingle. And I have one guest with me and that is Patrick Butler. Jingle jingle. And we're going to be doing my first game of Big John's PC version of Card Sharks in which I'll be... Playing against a computer player, since I know Patrick would rather spectate, which I'm okay with. And let's hope that the computer players get their decisions wrong. Thank you. All right. All right. Oh, let's go. Yep. Are ready yet, Patrick? Aubrey, let's go. Actually, we'll let the computer player be the champion, and I'll be at the challenger. I think I'm going to name the computer player Omarosa. Yeah. Start the game. Welcome to Car Sharks. I'm ready to go. Yep, I'm taking on Omarosa this game. All right, Omarosa. We asked 100 men married to full-time housewives. Could you soft boil an egg if your wife wasn't at home? Omarosa said 38 could. I'm gonna go higher. The actual answer is 91. It's a lot higher. I have a base card of a nine. I don't want it. That nine becomes a 10. I'll go lower. Oh, it's a king. And Omarosa has a free shot with a four. Higher. Ace. Lower. A five. Higher. A queen. Lower. It's a six. She got it. So now I'm going to have to tie this up. This is my question. We asked 100 people, have you taken revenge on an enemy of yours? I'll say 50 of them have. Omarosa, do you think it's higher or lower? Higher. The actual answer? 34, it's lower. Alright, so I have a free shot with a 6. Higher. Another 6. Alright, Omarosa, you have a 4. Higher. Jack. Lower. It's a queen! Another burp. Where are your manners? My manners are down to your toilet in 100 seat. women who had a baby after turning 40. Have you been mistaken for their baby's grandmother? 58 of them. I'll say lower. And I knew that, Patrick. The answer? 57! Just a little lower. I have a 6. I'm going to change it this time. It becomes a 5. Uh, no. Higher. 10. Lower. 9. Freeze. Alright, here's my question. How many... We asked 100 people in the Hawaii. Have you seen a volcano erupting? 75 of them have. Higher or lower, Omarosa? Lower. The answer? 52. It is lower. She has a 4. Keep it and go higher. 10. Lower. Five. Uh-oh. Higher. Nine. Is it lower? No. Nope. It's a king! It's not lower! Ah, uh, she goes all the way down. I'll go lower. Uh, wrong! Four. Higher! To tie up the match. Is it higher? It's a king! We have a tie game! Next round, only three cards will be dealt out. This is Omarosa's question. Here we go. In feet, what is the longest distance that a person has ever blown a flame out of his mouth? 93. That's got to be lower. 31. It's definitely lower. Three times lower. And I have a king. Lower. Four. Higher! Do I get to start a round if it's higher? 
Yes, I do! <laughs> Alright, so I get to start a run. And I'll play the money cards. I've got 200 bucks guaranteed. If I play my cards right, I could be walking away with a grand total of $65,600. All right, Joker's in the deck, okay. Already got one Joker. For $400, my base card is a nine. Change it with number one, bad card for me. That nine becomes another nine. Okay. I'll go 50 bucks, then it's lower. It's an eight. Okay. I'll do $50 again, then it's higher. It's an ace! All of it lower. It's an eight. So we move up to eight, get another $900. I have 1900 and an eight. I'll change it with number two. All right, that nine, that nine becomes, or an eight becomes a six, okay? I'll go $1,100 that it's higher. 1100 higher than a six, a seven. Okay, this time we'll go 1000 that it's higher. $1,000 higher than a seven, it's a six. I'll do another 1000 that it's higher. Half of it, $1,000 higher than a six, it's an ace! So we move up the ace to the big bet. I have to bet at least fifteen hundred. I'll do all three thousand lower. It's a four, so I get six thousand dollars in the money cards. Oh, but there's a ten thousand dollar jackpot out there that could be mine if I find the dollar sign with the if I find the card with the dollar sign behind it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I have a feeling it's a number three, so I'm gonna go with that. One out of seven shot that the ten, that the dollar sign is behind number three for ten thousand dollars. Is it behind number three? It is. So I have a one giveaway total of sixteen thousand two hundred dollars cash and prizes. Well, she did win one game, so she walked away with $100, but, hey, I had a great first game. I'll do a second game soon. I want to thank Patrick for being a part of the video. Yeah, thank you very much. You're welcome very much, and we'll see you again next time.